today Deuce and I are going to talk a little bit about working our stays. He's had a little trouble with getting the absolute concept that he needs to stay put when I leave him. Various positions standing or sitting down he's pretty good at, but I'm going to talk a little bit about beginner novice stays and what we're working on. So I'm going to sit him in the middle of the yard and I'm going to show you what I do for beginner novice. And then I'll up the ante if he does well. If he doesn't do well, I'll continue doing what I'm working on. So come here, buddy. Good boy. So I'm gonna sit him here. Go ahead and sit and take off his leash. Stay. I'm gonna lead away from him with my away foot so he doesn't think we're healing. I'm gonna walk straight away from him. And I walk over to the right. And I take a big wide circle of, of, around him. straight to him. He's done really good. Good. Reinforce it. Good stay. Good stay. Stay. I don't release him quite yet because I'm trying to proof him. And back to heel position. Good stay. Good stay. Good stay. I give him quite a few treats. Rewarding the stay. And then I make sure my release is really clear. Okay, good boy, good boy. That was awesome. Good boy. Okay, okay, okay. You did good. Okay, off. I know. Good, good boy. Okay, we're gonna do it again. Stay. And I'm gonna add in a distraction of throwing the toy. I might say good stay. I'm testing that stay for when I come to return. I don't want him to break. Good stay. Good stay. Good boy. Good stay. Good stay. So I jackpot this stay. A lot of times when I come back from a stay, my dogs are drooling because they know that they did good if they, they get a jackpot. Good stay. Good stay. Okay, good boy. Notice I reward him in the stay position, so that's what we're rewarding for. He knows that that's what I'm looking for, and then I, I release him into an okay. So I'm trying to make the okay release more uh, obvious to him, because when I, we do a stand, sometimes he'll move a foot or two. Come here. Good boy. Yeah. So, stand. Stay. I give him the stay. We do a really thorough exam so he's used to it. Let's stay. Good. St ah! Good stay. See, he likes to move his legs. This is really not a steady position. Good stay. Good stay. Good stay. good uh, stays for him I'm really happy with that so my next step is to do that when at a park out away from my backyard as that has become obvious that he needs more distractions outside his area that he is very familiar with so I'll be going to a park and doing this next and I think that will be a whole different ball game Lowe's Home Depot are also really good places to train your dog with distractions. You can put a do not pet thing on your lead so you don't get people you know, coming up and bombarding you when you're training. Um, I get my serious training face on and uh, I'm just focused on my dog and making sure there are no other dogs coming towards him like at a Lowe's or Home Depot or Park. 
um, but it's really good to proof your dogs in those in those areas outside of training center that they're used to and outside your backyard so happy training